September Tuesday First of all, let me get something straight. This is a journal, not a diary. I know what it says on the cover, but when Mom went out to buy this thing, I specifically told her to get one that didn't say diary on it. Great. All I need is for some jerk to catch me carrying this book around and get the wrong idea. September Tuesday. First of all, let me get something straight. This is a journal, not a diary. I know what it says on the cover, but when Mom went out to buy this thing, I specifically told her to get one that didn't say diary on it. Great. All I need is for some jerk to catch me carrying this book around and get the wrong idea. September. Tuesday. First of all, let me get something straight. This is a journal, not a diary. I know what it says on the cover, but when Mom went out to buy this thing, I specifically told her to get one that didn't say diary on it. Great. All I need is for some jerk to catch me carrying this book around and get the wrong idea. September. Tuesday. First of all, let me get something straight. This is a journal, not a diary. I know what it says on the cover, but when Mom went out to buy this thing, I specifically told her to get one that didn't say diary on it. Great. All I need is for some jerk to catch me carrying this book around and get the wrong idea. The other thing I want to clear up right away is that this was Mom's idea, not mine. But if she thinks I'm going to write down my feelings in here or whatever, she's crazy. So just don't expect me to be all Dear Diary this and Dear Diary that. The other thing I want to clear up right away is that this was Mom's idea, not mine. But if she thinks I'm going to write down my feelings in here or whatever, she's crazy. So just don't expect me to be all Dear Diary this and Dear Diary that. The other thing I want to clear up right away is that this was Mom's idea, not mine. But if she thinks I'm going to write down my feelings in here or whatever, she's crazy. So just don't expect me to be all Dear Diary this and Dear Diary that. The other thing I want to clear up right away is that this was Mom's idea, not mine. But if she thinks I'm going to write down my feelings in here or whatever, she's crazy. So just don't expect me to be all Dear Diary this and Dear Diary that. The only reason I agreed to do this at all is because I figure later on, when I'm rich and famous, I'll have better things to do than answer people's stupid questions all day long. So this book is going to come in handy. The only reason I agreed to do this at all is because I figure later on, when I'm rich and famous, I'll have better things to do than answer people's stupid questions all day long. So this book is going to come in handy. The only reason I agreed to do this at all is because I figure later on, when I'm rich and famous, 
I'll have better things to do than answer people's stupid questions all day long. So this book is going to come in handy. The only reason I agreed to do this at all is because I figure later on, when I'm rich and famous, I'll have better things to do than answer people's stupid questions all day long. So this book is going to come in handy. Like I said, I'll be famous one day, but for now, I'm stuck in middle school with a bunch of morons. Like I said, I'll be famous one day, but for now, I'm stuck in middle school with a bunch of morons. Like I said, I'll be famous one day, but for now, I'm stuck in middle school with a bunch of morons. Like I said, I'll be famous one day, but for now, I'm stuck in middle school with a bunch of morons. Let me just say for the record that I think middle school is the dumbest idea ever invented. You got kids like me who haven't hit their growth spurt yet mixed in with these gorillas who need to shave twice a day. Let me just say for the record that I think middle school is the dumbest idea ever invented. You got kids like me who haven't hit their growth spurt yet mixed in with these gorillas who need to shave twice a day. Let me just say for the record that I think middle school is the dumbest idea ever invented. You got kids like me who haven't hit their growth spurt yet mixed in with these gorillas who need to shave twice a day. Let me just say for the record that I think middle school is the dumbest idea ever invented. You got kids like me who haven't hit their growth spurt yet mixed in with these gorillas who need to shave twice a day. And then they wonder why bullying is such a big problem in middle school. If it was up to me, grade levels would be based on height, not age. But then again, I guess that would mean kids like Shira Gupta would still be in the first grade. And then they wonder why bullying is such a big problem in middle school. And then they wonder why bullying is such a big problem in middle school. If it was up to me, grade levels would be based on height, not age. If it was up to me, grade levels would be based on height, not age. But then again, I guess that would mean kids like Shira Gupta would still be in the first grade. But then again, I guess that would mean kids like Shira Gupta would still be in the first grade. And then they wonder why bullying is such a big problem in middle school. And then they wonder why bullying is such a big problem in middle school. If it was up to me, grade levels would be based on height, not age. If it was up to me, grade levels would be based on height, not age. But then again, I guess that would mean kids like Shira Gupta would still be in the first grade. But then again, 
I guess that would mean kids like Shira Gupta would still be in the first grade. And then they wonder why bullying is such a big problem in middle school. If it was up to me, grade levels would be based on height, not age. But then again, I guess that would mean kids like Shira Gupta would still be in the first grade. Today is the first day of school, and right now we're waiting around for the teacher to hurry up and finish the seating chart. So I figured I might as well write in this book to pass the time. Today is the first day of school. Today is the first day of school, and right now we're waiting around for the teacher to hurry up and finish the seating chart. And right now we're waiting around for the teacher to hurry up and finish the seating chart. So I figured I might as well write in this book to pass the time. So I figured I might as well write in this book to pass the time. Today is the first day of school. Today is the first day of school. And right now we're waiting around for the teacher to hurry up and finish the seating chart. And right now we're waiting around for the teacher to hurry up and finish the seating chart. So I figured I might as well write in this book to pass the time. So I figured I might as well write in this book to pass the time. Today is the first day of school, and right now we're waiting around for the teacher to hurry up and finish the seating chart. So I figured I might as well write in this book to pass the time. By the way, let me give you some good advice. On the first day of school, you got to be real careful where you sit. You walk into the classroom and just plunk your stuff down on any old desk, and the next thing you know, the teacher is saying, By the way, let me give you some good advice. By the way, let me give you some good advice. On the first day of school, you got to be real careful where you sit. On the first day of school, you got to be real careful where you sit. You walk into the classroom and just plunk your stuff down on any old desk, and the next thing you know, the teacher is saying, You walk into the classroom and just plunk your stuff down on any old desk, and the next thing you know, the teacher is saying, by the way, let me give you some good advice. By the way, let me give you some good advice. On the first day of school, you got to be real careful where you sit. On the first day of school, you got to be real careful where you sit. You walk into the classroom and just plunk your stuff down on any old desk, and the next thing you know, the teacher is saying, You walk into the classroom and just plunk your stuff down on any old desk, and the next thing you know, the teacher is saying, 마지막으로 영어 문장을 보며 낭독합니다. 반복 없이 한 번만 재생됩니다. By the way, let me give you some good advice. On the first day of school, you got to be real careful where you sit. 
You walk into the classroom and just plunk your stuff down on any old desk, and the next thing you know, the teacher is saying, I hope you all like where you're sitting because these are your permanent seats. So in this class, I got stuck with Chris Hosey in front of me and Lionel James in back of me. 영어 문장과 해석을 보며 낭독합니다. 두 번씩 반복 재생됩니다. I hope you all like where you're sitting because these are your permanent seats. I hope you all like where you're sitting because these are your permanent seats. So in this class, I got stuck with Chris Hosey in front of me and Lionel James in back of me. So in this class, I got stuck with Chris Hosey in front of me and Lionel James in back of me. 해석을 보며 낭독합니다. 두 번씩 반복 재생됩니다. 너희들이 지금 앉은 자리가 마음에 들었으면 좋겠어. 왜냐하면 그 자리가 너희들이 영구적으로 앉아야 할 자리거든. I hope you all like where you're sitting because these are your permanent seats. 너희들이 지금 앉은 자리가 마음에 들었으면 좋겠어. 왜냐하면 그 자리가 너희들이 영구적으로 앉아야 할 자리거든. I hope you all like where you're sitting because these are your permanent seats. 그래서 나는 우리 반에서 내 앞에 있는 크리스 후지와 내 뒤에 있는 라이언을 제임스 사이에 꼼짝없이 갇혀버렸어. So in this class, I got stuck with Chris Hosey in front of me and Lionel James in back of me. 그래서 나는 우리 반에서 내 앞에 있는 크리스 후지와 내 뒤에 있는 라이언을 제임스 사이에 꼼짝없이 갇혀버렸어. So in this class, I got stuck with Chris Hosey in front of me and Lionel James in back of me. 마지막으로 영어 문장을 보며 낭독합니다. 반복 없이 한 번만 재생됩니다. I hope you all like where you're sitting because these are your permanent seats. So in this class, I got stuck with Chris Hosey in front of me and Lionel James in back of me. Jason Brill came in late and almost sat to my right, but luckily I stopped that from happening at the last second. 영어 문장과 해석을 보며 낭독합니다. 두 번씩 반복 재생됩니다. Jason Brill came in late and almost sat to my right. Jason Brill came in late and almost sat to my right, but luckily I stopped that from happening at the last second. But luckily, I stopped that from happening at the last second. 해석을 보며 낭독합니다. 두 번씩 반복 재생됩니다. Jason Brill이 늦게 와서 하마터면 내 옆에 앉을 뻔했는데. Jason Brill came in late and almost sat to my right. Jason Brill이 늦게 와서 하마터면 내 옆에 앉을 뻔했는데. Jason Brill came in late and almost sat to my right. 다행히도 그런 일이 일어나지 않도록 마지막 순간에 내가 막았어. But luckily, I stopped that from happening at the last second. 다행히도 그런 일이 일어나지 않도록 마지막 순간에 내가 막았어. But luckily, I stopped that from happening at the last second. 마지막으로 영어 문장을 보며 낭독합니다. 반복 없이 한 번만 재생됩니다. Jason Brill came in late and almost sat to my right, but luckily, I stopped that from happening at the last second.
영어 문장을 보며 낭독합니다. 반복 없이 한 번만 재생됩니다. Next period. I should just sit in the middle of a bunch of hot girls as soon as I step in the room. But I guess if I do that, it just proves I didn't learn anything from last year. 영어 문장과 해석을 보며 낭독합니다. 두 번씩 반복 재생됩니다. Next period. I should just sit in the middle of a bunch of hot girls as soon as I step in the room. Next period. I should just sit in the middle of a bunch of hot girls as soon as I step in the room. But I guess if I do that, it just proves I didn't learn anything from last year. But I guess if I do that, it just proves I didn't learn anything from last year. 해석을 보며 낭독합니다. 두 번씩 반복 재생됩니다. 다음 시간에는 교실에 들어가자마자 인기 있는 여자 아이들 무리 속 중간에 앉는 것이 좋을 것 같아. Next period. I should just sit in the middle of a bunch of hot girls as soon as I step in the room. 다음 시간에는 교실에 들어가자마자 인기 있는 여자 아이들 무리 속 중간에 앉는 것이 좋을 것 같아. Next period. I should just sit in the middle of a bunch of hot girls as soon as I step in the room. 만약에 그런다면 나는 작년에 있었던 일로부터 하나도 배운 게 없다는 게 증명되는 꼴이겠지. But I guess if I do that, it just proves I didn't learn anything from last year. 만약에 그런다면 나는 작년에 있었던 일로부터 하나도 배운 게 없다는 게 증명되는 꼴이겠지. But I guess if I do that, it just proves I didn't learn anything from last year. 마지막으로 영어 문장을 보며 낭독합니다. 반복 없이 한 번만 재생됩니다. Next period. I should just sit in the middle of a bunch of hot girls as soon as I step in the room. But I guess if I do that, it just proves I didn't learn anything from last year.